Tonight, a warning for parents about a dangerous TikTok trend. A 12 year old Aurora boy is fighting for his life after taking part in the so called blackout challenge. Denver 7 Sloan Dickey talked with that boy's dad, who is sharing his story so other parents don't feel the same pain. He wants to be fit. He wants to be counted for and he just pushes himself. Joshua Haliasis is a hardworking 12 year old. He wants to be an actor. He had a submit a video acting to Simbot app. Sharing his achievements online from acting to playing the guitar. He worked so hard. He bought a guitar to play on it. He taught himself from YouTube to cooking. He does work hard to impress me, impress everyone. He learned all that on YouTube. He, he, he knows all the spices and all those things that I don't know about. Now he's in a fight for his life. I never ever imagined this. He would do anything like this. He, he has plans, he has visions, he has a lot of things that he wants to do. Last week, Joshua participated in the so-called blackout challenge, a trend on TikTok that encourages participants to choke themselves until they pass out. The videos are so disturbing, Denver 7 has decided not to share them. I would never ever imagine and he would do such a thing, but the fact that he's exposed to ideas like this kind of ideas, it's just crazy. Man. And Joshua's parents aren't alone. Kids across the country are giving in to this dangerous TikTok trend. The kids especially, they don't know that fragile, how the fragile they are. Now Joshua's family is warning all parents this is serious and deadly. I don't know why people would do such a thing. I don't know why people would post those things. Then maybe they're looking at it as a game. Maybe they're looking at it as a prank. Maybe they're trying to see their viewers could laugh about it. For a week, doctors at Children's Hospital Colorado have been working to save Joshua, his parents hoping and praying. My God is a miracle worker. I'm praying. I needed some time to um, just for him to come out. A young boy in the fight of his life because of a social media challenge that went too far. It could be a prank, whatever it is. This is not a joke. This is not a, a game to play with. You know, I, I am going through this pain, but I don't think anybody needs to go through this pain. And this evening, family, friends, and neighbors of Joshua gathered at Children's Hospital for a prayer vigil that ended about an hour ago. His parents say they wanted to get a story out for two reasons, to ask for prayers for their son and to tell parents across Colorado to talk with their kids about this dangerous trend. Reporting in Aurora Sloan Dickey, Denver 7.